Hey up and welcome to Callum's Corner. My God, what are you looking at? That, that's revolting. Yes, my hairline goes back to Narnia. It's so unprofessional. I right? had a business meeting. It's all about my want to work for the BBC. Uh, uh, I got there, you know, I'm feeling good about myself. I go into the interview. It's a lovely young transgender person who's interviewing me, right? I was just doing what I'd normally do, chatting to her, like, you right, pet, how you doing? You know, I'm available, uh, six foot five, um, sit hat off so you can see that. What did she say? She said, I'm sorry, we can't accept this. You have a receding hairline. But I wasn't having that. So I said to him, look mate, I'm happy to grow my hair. It's only short for kind of self-defense purposes. And he interrupts me as I'm saying, he goes, we cannot accept slapheads. I said, okay, mate, that's fine. You can't accept it. Why don't you get your manager down here now? And right, this bloke, simpering little man comes out and he starts explaining to me that there were complaints about me. And he says, oh, I don't want to embarrass you. But apparently you were chucked out of McDonald's for having a tantrum because of top not envy. Alright, my sex life has been ruined by this. But now it's holding back my career. Bloody Alan Shearer and stuff and big BBC bullies and stuff. They don't come across these kind of hurdles. Unbelievable. Now I'm trying to put myself out there. Change careers, change direction and go for a dream job. Um, and they've come back. They said, oh, no, we can't do that, Callum. Would you like some free Tic Tacs? I had to remove myself from the situation at the end. I was going to go mental, mental chicken. No, it's not going to work. It's not going to work. There's Tic Tacs buddy everywhere now. My mum's going to kill me. I better get clearing this up. It's all going wrong, as you can see. Yes, I'm angry again, but with bloody good reason. Okay, that's the end of the video. I, I failed. I failed. I don't feel I'm to blame. I feel like we should blame Tom Sockdale and Wayne fucking Rooney and bloody Elspeth and McDonald's and the BBC. Yeah, dirty little spasmoids. Why is that not stopping? Oh, probably because I've got to say. Shout out to Lord Elvis. He's a dead, dead good bloke. And then, then. Cut.